Hi, I'm Bruce Dorn. I've been a photographer and a filmmaker for 50 years, and I consider myself to be a storyteller. And what a story I have to share with you. I'm just back from Kenya where I made a bunch of beautiful stills and I shot 4K video with the R5C. This thing is amazing. We went to Amboseli National Park in Kenya. I had heard about it for years but had never been there. It's apparently the Eden for elephants, the last refuge of the big tuskers. I was looking forward to getting shots of them with all the green grasses and Kilimanjaro in the background, but what I found was quite different. They're currently in a major drought and it has been tragic. So this is a story of wildlife, water, and the search for the same. So I know and love the R5 and I shoot video with the R5, but the R5C just does it better. It's a full cinema camera in the same body. When I switch it from still mode to video mode, now it's a cinema camera. I have the scopes, I have all of the stuff that a proper cinema camera has in an R5 body. And check it out, it's actually got cooling fans. In the hot conditions of Kenya, it was essential that this thing ran cool. Never had a single problem. So I took it as a personal challenge to approach this just the way an amateur photographer would on their first safari, but with the addition of 4K video. I did everything I would normally do. I used all the equipment I would normally use, but I had the option of shifting from photo to video mode. The results were stunning. I encourage everybody to explore cinema, even if you've never thought about doing it before. In still capture mode, I shot RAWs just like I always do. In cinema mode, I shot an H.265, a very efficient Kodak. I shot at 60 frames per second, and I shot at 90 frames per second, so I had nice slow motion. Shooting handheld, I got right in the middle of the action. I took great advantage of the flip out LCD so I could get down in the mud and high overhead. When the dancers were going crazy, I was right in the middle of it. Shoot handheld, go for it. It was a great safari and I made some great new friends. And I got a whole bunch of really wonderful stills and I got good video. I fulfilled my personal challenge of shooting stills and shooting video. And you know what, the next time I go out, I'm gonna do it again. Handheld, minimal kit. Give it a try, you'll be impressed.